I'm here because George Osborne talked about a million jobs being lost when we absolutely knew a simple vote for Brexit wasn't going to result in a million job losses. I'm here because Mark Carney said that he had to put £250 billion aside just in case there was a run on the banks because we voted for Brexit. And to just steal one of the Liberal Democrats' words, that's all <laughs> But we did, against all those warnings, all those lies, dare I say it, we did vote for Brexit. And guess what? The United Kingdom ended 2016 as the fastest growing country in the G7. <laughs> On the 21st of January this year, the FT declared that all major economists believe that in the event of a no deal there will be no recession. Was that publicized? I don't think we heard it. Then in March this year, Mark Carney, a complete pivot, said that actually all the banks were ready for a no deal Brexit. The financial sector is absolutely ready for it. And I read today that last year 507,000 people were employed in the city. That's 8,000 more than were employed the year before that.